Well, our top story tonight, yet another deadly crash involving a motorcycle. This happened over the weekend. Such a tragedy. Yeah. You know, as we told you at four, one person is dead after a chase involving a motorcycle ended in a crash in Sevier County. 32-year-old Zachary Gorman was thrown from his motorcycle. He was pronounced dead at the scene. In light of that tragic crash, several people around our community are now pleading for drivers to be extremely vigilant when out on the roadways. WAT6 on your side reporter Paige Week spoke to a local motorcycle president who has developed his own motorcycle safety techniques. So Paige uh, joins us live in the studio with more of what he had to say. Paige. Well, Lori and Bo, every time a motorcycle crash happens, groups across the community begin roll call. It's a way to make sure group members are safe and accounted for. It's a practice that seems to be happening more and more as the number of motorcycle crashes continues to rise. But like you said, one man hopes to help make that number go down. Jack Lakin has been riding motorcycles for years. There's nothing better than motorcycling. It's a lot of fun if you've, you know, there's a, that's why there's so many of us out there. But he's also seen the dark side of the hobby. I've had friends die. It's because of those friends that Lakin works to educate and protect his fellow motorcyclists using three simple pieces of advice. The first one is I assume nobody sees me. Getting to that intersection, if you'll take your handlebars and just wiggle. Just like this. And immediately they look at it and they go, wow, what was that? Lakin's next step, be a front wheel watcher. If you see that front wheel rotate, start braking. That's a sign that they don't see you. Lakin's third tip, flash them. I take my, my brake and I flash it. Boop, boop. I see you. Do you see me? Three easy steps, life-saving effects. Stone tablet, Ten Commandments, you know, those are in stone for me. Although most of Lakin's advice is aimed toward bikers, he sums up his advice for drivers in three words. Always look twice. How much time does it take me to do this? I mean, is that less than five seconds? It's a piece of advice that's echoed by the Knoxville Fire Department. When a motorcycle may be passing you, you may not see them as easily. So take that extra second or two to really look around and make sure there's not one there. And if you look close enough, you'll notice motorcyclists trying to do the exact same thing as you. Everybody that rides, they all have a way of, you know, dropping that hand and giving a signal to each other. You know what? We're just telling you, get home safe. For more motorcycle safety advice, look for the story on WATE.com. There you'll find links to even more resources for car drivers and motorcyclists alike. Lori, Bo. All right, Paige, thank you so much. And another piece of advice for you, Lakin says, try wearing bright colored clothing or clothing that doesn't match your bike. The mismatch of colors can help drivers distinguish you while you're on the road.